Good evening, I'm Barbara Brozier. Republican Representative Todd Rokita will participate in the upcoming Senate GOP primary debate after all. The Indiana Debate Commission announced last month Rokita would be the first candidate in 10 years to skip the debate. But now, the Senate candidate will take part. A spokesperson says Rokita will act as a check to his opponents, fellow Representative Luke Messer and former state lawmaker Mike Braun. Construction on Bloomington Switchyard Park will start next month after the Redevelopment Commission approved the $34 million needed for the project. The funding comes from TIF dollars, which are funds from area property taxes used to promote redevelopment. This is a momentous day for the city, a momentous uh, investment for the city to create a beautiful, big, state-of-the-art 65-acre park on the south side. A coming soon sign is posted at the former site of Wee Willies on South Walnut Street. That property, along with another piece of land on Rogers Street, will serve as the park's main entrance. And an attempted murder suspect who shot himself in the head after fleeing police died in the hospital today. Police say Brandon Richardson was declared dead this afternoon. They apprehended him Friday near Vernal Pike after Richardson fled, hit several squad cars, and then shot himself. The 34-year-old was accused of tying a woman up with a dog leash, then beating and strangling her over a period of three days. Now let's take a look at your weather forecast. Tonight, a low of 38 degrees, mostly cloudy skies. Tomorrow, there is a chance for rain, a 30% chance of showers. I have 66 degrees. Thursday, partly sunny with a high of 51, but warming up for the weekend, sunny skies and a high of 57 Friday. Thanks for joining us. Have a great night.